Digital radio, like the ones on Motorola's Moto Turbo platform, have been out for almost 15 years now. And while advancement in two-way radio technology has brought about light data applications, such as job ticketing and GPS, I still wouldn't consider a two-way radio a smart device. Now radios such as the Moto Turbo Ion are true smart devices, with a full touchscreen and Android operating system. But what about the millions of radios that are used by customers today? How can we take these devices and turn them into smarter devices? I've been literally thinking about this for years, and the solution is so simple that I'm embarrassed to call it a revelation at all. The solution is pairing your radios with a voice assistant. Alexa, what's the weather? The current weather is 47 degrees Fahrenheit with cloudy skies. Today's forecast has showers with a high of 48 degrees and a low of 34 degrees. Of course, the voice assistant will need to be somewhere centrally located in your facility with access to power and the internet. You need to place the two-way radio next to the voice assistant and program it with FOX. FOX stands for Voice Operated Exchange. Basically, you can use voice to bypass the need to press a PTT button. So I push you talk a question to Alexa. Alexa, what is 48 times 48? Alexa responds with the answer. 48 times 48 is 2,304. Alexa's voice automatically initiates the radio call back to me, and I hear the answer. 2,304. That means any worker with a radio anywhere within range can access things like basic internet inquiries, calculator, weather reports, and language translate. We close at 5 o'clock. In Spanish is... Cerramos a las 5 en punto. I've only had this Alexa for a short time, so I'm by no means an expert on everything it can do. And I will pump the brakes here and say that this device is definitely for consumer use. But I do see future commercial applications for building automation for things like lights, access control, HVAC, and alarms. Alexa, turn on first light. Okay. It does take a little bit of tinkering before you get the right levels for volume and Fox dialed in. And look, anyone that owns a voice assistant will tell you that it doesn't always operate perfectly. Absolutely. Happy to help. And look at my setup. Not the most elegant solution. But this was just a demonstration to show you that yes, it can work and perhaps paves the way for more professional applications using two-way radio and voice assistants. What applications do you see having a good fit? This was Jeff with Day Wireless. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one.